Check out. Hi, Mark here from Stan Cash. It's winter and that means that a lot of people are buying slow cookers. And so when you get a slow cooker, one of the great things is that you get to come home and smell some great aromas that are coming out of this machine. Today, we're very lucky to have Marie from Russell Hobbs, who's gonna tell us all about the Russell Hobbs Searing Slow Cooker. Marie, welcome. Thank you, Mark. <laughs> um, the Searing Slow Cooker, I think, is a fantastic product because you can actually take the pan out, put it onto the stove, and do all your searing here in the pan. The advantage of that is you don't have another pan to uh, clean afterwards, just one product. And but also I guess all the flavours, because all usually the flavors you, stay yeah, in. you yeah. usually throw all the oils and all that out, yeah. so all the flavours are going to stay in here That's as well. It's all there in your slow cooker. Mm -hmm. You have a nice glass lid so you can actually see what you're doing as well while it's cooking. And, and what about, so I can see in the front there you've got, uh, there's some three different functions there. So low and high and keep warm so when would I use when would I use those particular functions okay if you you, you want to um, use your slow cooker in the morning leave it cooking while you're going off to work you'd set it onto the low setting and have your and that's because it's a lower temperature it is it? a lower temperature yeah and you can leave it cooking all day okay safely knowing that it's going to be cooked when you get home mm -hmm. um, once it's finished its cooking time because you can select the temperature um, or the, the cooking time that you want It'll switch over to, to warm, yes, which is good, and it will keep warm for up to ten hours. Okay, not and that you want it to keep warm for ten hours, but it will do that. I guess because you keep it warm for ten hours, it probably might just turn into mush. Mush, <laughs> okay. exactly. Right. <laughs> Fair enough. And with the um, and there's also high there, so high. I guess the temperature is going to be a bit higher. So then I would, you know, if I, maybe if I come back from work and I forgot to put it on, then I'd put it on to high. Yeah, usually um, with myself, <clears> I, I'll if I'm home on the weekend, I'll cook it on high for about four hours, mm -hmm. and that's long enough. Because the whole point of a slow cooker is that it cooks slowly and so all the flavours get infused, I guess, into, into the, the food. food. Yeah. yeah, and then when you take that bone out, it just sort of, the meat just drops Falls off the bone. Off. Yeah, leaves it nice and tender. Wonderful. Yeah. That's great. So if you'd like to get uh, one of these slow cookers, why not uh, shop with us at stancash.com.au by clicking the link below. And thanks, Marie, for coming in. Thank you, Mark.